news. We take a look at the news stories that may not be on your radar, but they should be. A Pennsylvania homeowner went to investigate the sound of singing coming from her kitchen, only to find a naked man drinking milk. Now, to his surprise, Santa and Mrs. Claus were having a squabble. Now, unless she lets him back in the house, Christmas is going to be late this year and drunk. In other news, something called the Jesus Shoe is being sold for as much as $3,000 online. There you see it. What is the Jesus Shoe? Not the Tevas I grew up with. A Nike Air Max with holy water injected into the air bubble. For $3,000, that holy water better turn into wine with a side of fish and $3,000. In other news, Toys R Us has relaunched its website, but shoppers looking to make a purchase will be redirected to Target.com. That story again, go to Target.com. In other news, Drexel University has agreed to pay the federal government over $189,000 after one of their professors used federal grant money at strip clubs instead of on energy and naval technology. In his defense, there were navels and there was energy, as long as he didn't go to Camelot. And finally, a woman was arrested when a cop who pulled her over for driving with an expired registration realized a bow in her hair was actually a bag of meth. And by the looks of the photo, not all geniuses are professors at Drexel. Very well done, lady. You have a future. Let me know what you think of these stories. Use the hashtag GetUpDC.